Hey guys, it's Michael Staub over here, and today we're going to be talking about wrongful convictions. This is the very first episode of my True Crime News Magazine series, so if you guys want more of these, be sure to give this video a like. I'll be doing a lot more true crime in the future. So anyway, let's get on to the series, or episode. <laughs> There are many types of criminal charges you can get, but I'm going to list a few of them because the list is usually really, really, really long. All right. So one of them can be arson. If you guys don't know what arson is, it's willingly burning down a building, which I'm going to explain more of. There's also murder, which is a popular type of true crime. You always find that sort of stuff online. There's also burglary, as well as fraud. With fraud, like, you know, um... Falsifying documents, that's one of them. There's also a DUI, which means driving under the influence. So those are some of the criminal charges you get. There's many more, so if you guys really want more of that, you guys can go check it out online. Alright, there's more people that were convicted of wrongful convictions, and I will be giving you guys a few of them because there's a lot of them. So, according to my notes over here, Lena Baker was convicted of murder. There was Clarence Earl Gideon, who was also convicted, but for theft. And then we got Otis Boone, which is a more modern conviction, which is which he got convicted for robbery. Alright, so there's going to be a lot more of those. Like, I went on Wikipedia and I found a lot of people that were wrongfully convicted. And if you guys will, so if you guys really want me to do an entire series of people getting wrongfully convicted, both older and newer ones, be sure to give this video a like. But anyways, I think that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want me to do more wrongful convictions, be sure to give this video a like. And don't forget to subscribe. I'm Michael Stolp. Content you will enjoy.